should be doing this. So Barb mentioned, you know, the graffiti, and I think anything we can do to make sure the city stays beautiful and this becomes a less appealing place uh, for people to uh, tag the things on our sides of our buildings and our public infrastructure, um, that's a good thing. Secondly, I think it just contributes. I can see from the joy on people's faces up on the bridge and indeed even cycling along here that part of a livable, livable city is something that celebrates uh, arts, it celebrates artistic works, it makes the city kind of a fun, a more fun place to be, a more enjoyable place to be, and that's important. And finally, um, it is a city, we are a city, which understands uh, the importance of art, of the arts and of artists, and of the importance of that, not just to what is a big industry that employs a lot of people in and of itself, but also the importance of the arts to being an innovative city that attracts people from all around the world. You know, some, everybody in the most diverse city in the world could come here, and even if they couldn't speak English or any other language to each other, they could all stand here together and admire Justice's work. And that's a really important thing about the arts, whether it's visual arts or music, and it's part of an expression of the soul of the city. And even though this part of the soul of the city is expressed by a visitor, and now a member of the family from Chicago, Justice Row, um, it is an important part of exposing the soul of our city. And so I support strongly these kinds of uh, projects this one in particular has an added element to it that I think you know. And the reason that we're fortunate enough to have Justice Rowe here uh, to do this work is because Toronto and Chicago, which have been, for many years been twin cities, um, had a, a, a deal as part of Canada 150 whereby they would send us one of their best and most talented artists to do a piece of public art, street art like this, and we in turn are sending a Toronto artist down to Chicago very soon in, in the summer uh, to uh, do uh, a piece of work there. And I can only tell you from my conversations, and I think some of you were up top and heard Justice talking about how hard he worked and how big an assignment